Now we're going to explain how to do left-right offsets on the implements. So number one, we have to get out of the run screen, come back to our home screen, and go into our configuration menu because we have to be out of the field because it will move us on the guidance line since we were doing an offset with the implement. So I went into my configuration menu and I'm going to select implement. And we're going to go to setup and then we're going to hit our measurements tab. And we see all the way down here at the left, we've got left right offset. We hit that box and we can tell it if we want to go left or right and we can tell in feet and inches how much. So here we are going to explain how we figure our left right offset. So in our tractor we're going to recommend making three passes. So we're going to go like this. I usually recommend drop the planter in the ground for 15 feet or so, strip till bar, whatever you're doing. Drop it in the ground for about 15 feet. Come right back around so that way we know we have no GPS drift. And we're going to turn around again. So in this area we're going to have about 15 feet where we were exactly on the guidance line. So we're engaged on the guidance line and we're going to go out and measure with a tape measure our guest rows in this area right here. So as we think about this, we are going this direction there, we are going this direction there, and this direction here. So if our guess rows are on 30 inch spacing, let's say we went out and measured and we're seeing 28 inches here and we're seeing 32 inches here. In this case, we are showing that we are offset to the right one inch. So, right one inch. How we are going to determine that is, if we think about it, in this case, when we were traveling this direction, our implement was trailing to the right one inch too far. So I like to draw myself arrows. When I came back this way, our implement was to the right, one inch too far. So that made our guess row 28 inches. When I turned around, again, I was to the right, one inch too far. So between these two passes, this made my guess row two inches too wide, which made it 32 inches. So this is how I have come up with a one inch to the right offset. So on the display, we're going to go back and we're going to hit inches. And I'm going to type in one, one inch to the right. Another thing to point out here is, in this case, I'm doing this on a whiteboard, so obviously these are ideal circumstances. Let's say that our spacing here turned out to be 34 inches and over there it was 28 inches. That would mean we have a mixture of a left-right offset issue as well as the planter width issue. So in this case we would have to go to the drawing board, figure out what our planer width should actually be and then we figure out what our offset is.